We already have pretty good data from Great River Energy. The scope of the project is large. End goal is to create a solar charging station. Do we know his choice of solar panels yet? Yeah. They see a need and a want um, in a space in their park where people can go, they can sit down, enjoy a nice picnic table. Having the real system come out here. And then while they're doing that, they can plug you know, in their laptops, the their phones, tablets, what have you. A little bit further. So through the Sustainable Communities Partnership, um, we're thinking of different sustainable oriented projects that um, University of St. Thomas students could help City of Elk River with. This says float charge 13-2. I personally have no background in, um, nor do any of our other staff at the City of Elk River, um, to be able to set something like this up. So to have engineering students at St. Thomas be able to uh, design and then actually physically produce the project for placement in the city of Elk River is just very exciting. It's cool seeing how you can put together an off-grid system, learning about that, and it's, it's super relevant today because solar and, and off-grid and even grid-tied systems are getting so popular. This is a really great stepping stone for our own city staff and city council to see um, how a a model such as this can work in real life and hopefully get that discussion rolling to see bigger installations at the city scale. They've been extremely responsive not just to what we've delivered but in essence maybe um, overwhelmed and we feel good about that because that means we managed our budget properly, we managed our scheduling, we worked well as a team, we planned properly and we delivered something that the client did not expect but in a positive way. It's kind of cool it's a different type of feedback from getting an A on a test, it's just a cappy customer. I learned a lot about parts of electrical engineering. I have an EE minor, but there's so much these guys know that I didn't know. You know so I'm coming into it and I'm like, whoa. We've had several people just stop by and uh, test it out by charging their iPhones, Androids. Uh, we're not too picky on type of phone, uh, just let it charge. You can bring these ideas um, to light through city staff discussions. These are the full standard size. And maybe citizen um, requests, but we don't have engineering staff at the city level, um, especially not electrical engineers, that would be able to take the time to design and produce something as elaborate as um, was created with the University of St. Thomas partnership. It was challenging, absolutely worth it. The stress that you go through, the extra hours that you put in, the planning that you do, it all pays off uh, when you're at the design show on a nice sunny day. This is something that you would see in the professional world, um, I would think, and so it's just outstanding the, the amount of expertise that was really um, able to be provided for um, the city of Elk River through the university.